Hello and welcome to my very first Hearts of Iron 4 or Hearts of Iron period uh, series on YouTube. I've played a lot of Heart, Hearts of Iron, played it from the very beginning, played a lot of Hearts of Iron 3. Never uploaded a video uh, of it. It just wasn't one of those games that I liked recording. Um, it, so I, I, I just, well, I didn't. Now, when Hearts of Iron 4 first came out, I played it for about 20, 20 hours, I think, something like that. And I really sucked at it. Uh, I just, the whole new setup of letting the AI, uh, you know, creating front lines and then creating a, um, an offensive line and letting the AI run, I was just wasn't getting it. And I don't know, I, I guess I just wasn't in the mood to play it or understand it. So I let it go for a long time. And just recently, started getting back into it and I've been playing it off camera for quite a while and and uh, I kind of got you know not a full understanding but enough to where I think it, it's not going to be absolutely terrible to watch so we are going to uh, we're going to do this I'm not the only mod that I install have installed is the uh, is a mod that changed the Germany's flag back to uh, to the swastika um, and yeah, that's it uh, as far as mod goes. So let's get started. Uh, we're going to do single player. We're going to do new game. Do the 36 select. Going to play the Reich. Select country. Um, going to play on regular difficulty because, like I said, I'm uh, still a noob. I have yet to do an invasion of Russia. The games I've played have just been messing around with uh i invaded norway once and that became a real big cluster so i've tried naval invasions i've had some six i have a i've had very little success with naval invasions i've messed around with paratroopers a little bit so okay um we're gonna we're going to go regular difficulty and we're going to go with the historical AI focus. Now, I think it would be really exciting to play a game without historical AI focus and change some things. But th this game here, I'm, I'm going to, uh, I'm not going, uh, I'm going to somewhat follow. Uh, I'll probably attack Poland earlier uh, than, you know, September of, of 39. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll stick with historical, and, and, and later I may do a run with without historical. Okay, so instead of rambling, uh, let's go ahead and start. Okay, it is Germany. It is January uh, the 1st of 1936, and the first thing we'll look at, we go up here, and this is like, this lets you know what needs attention so we have research slots available so we'll just go here and we I, I focus heavily on industry and engineering at at the start of the game so we'll go with uh, basic machine tools and then here we will go with uh, construction and then here we will go with um, oil plants um, so let's get those oil plants level two i can already do uh i can already build synthetic i call them oil plants it's synthetic refineries we can do level one but we're going to get that to level two um hmm. well if we can already do level one we don't really need level two right off the bat so let's not research that let's go to engineering and let's get that started research and then let's see here can't do anything in tanks um i'm going to want to build anti-tank yeah let's go ahead and get get these set up uh we need anti-tank 
guns. So let's research that. Okay. Um, we have free civilian factories. So what I am going to do, because Germany at the start, um, insufficient resources. Uh, they are lacking 15 oil and 5 rubber. Now, if I build <clears throat> synthetic refineries, each one of them, <clears throat> excuse me, it's early in the morning. Uh, okay, if I, each one of these gives me six or seven oil and four rubber. So instead of investing, I only have 15 free um, civilian factories. If I was to trade for oil, it, I have to trade away civilian factories. So instead of trading them away at the beginning of the game, I'm just going to invest them in in uh, synthetic refineries, and we'll we'll have a uh, we'll have a shortage of oil and rubber at the beginning. Uh, but that's fine. So let's. Uh, Let's go back to trade. So we are short 15 oil and five rubber. That ain't much. I'm going to go ahead and build quite a few synthetic refineries. So I'm going to build one, two, three, four, five. Six. Let's do eight. We're going to build eight refineries. Uh, so that will that will that should be enough for for quite some time okay uh we now have a free military factory so let's set this up um okay we want to get the light tanks all the way up we want to get support equipment all the way up Toad artillery. Get the motorized. Our fighters. Get them up like that. Close air support. Tactical bombers. Build aircraft. We want naval. We want naval bombers. Um. Okay, we got we got fighters, close air support, tactical, naval bombers, motorized light tank, towed artillery. Towed anti-air. I don't really use anti-air that much. Fighter, close air, naval, tack. Transport strategic bombers. The DO-19 is a strategic bomber. So I have to remember that. I get those confused. Um, yeah. Um, okay. So let's get rid of that. So we have, what, one more free. Uh, we'll put it in. Uh, I'll put it in artillery. Okay, fine. Uh, now we need to set a uh, uh, no na no national focus has been set, and I always at first I just go with the Rhineland uh, 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 militarized the the Rhineland, uh, so we'll just select it and start, and then we have no divisions and basic training, so. Um, we are going to train, uh, well, if you look at our standard infantry division, 
It has nine battal nine infantry battalions. It has uh, engineer and support artillery. Okay, so we're going to train. And we're going to adjust that later once we have the uh, army experience to do it. But uh, we're going to go ahead and train ten at a time. Ten divisions. Um, and we'll put them location will be Brandenburg. Um, also, we're going to, uh, if we look here at our Panzer divisions, uh, it is light, four light Panzer battalions, two motorized, with recon, engineering, and support artillery. Um, so we are going to get, uh, train four of those. And we're going to put those also in Brandenburg. Okay. All right. All right, that'll be fine there. And then we have uh, unassigned divisions and insufficient resources. Now, insufficient resources. Okay. So we're good on tungsten. All right, great. Oh shit! You know what? I I I need to go back here to production and and work on the naval. Uh, okay, so they they're doing a couple of battleships down here. Uh, we're gonna get rid of this one. Okay, I guess we could leave this one. Just have one factory working it. Um, let's add another factory to that one. Uh, submarines let's put them on continuous uh, destroyers I say put those on continuous also and uh, we have 199 convoys let's go ahead and produce some convoys um, and we'll put those on two I guess that's fine. I guess that's fine. Okay. Uh, yeah, back to insufficient resources. Wow, we have a huge deficit in oil and uh, rubber. But that's fine. That'll sort itself out as we build the refineries. Uh, so I'm not going to. I'm not going to use my civilian factories for trade. I'm going to use them to build refineries and just suffer the, the, uh, the loss of oil at the beginning. Fine. Um, okay. So next thing I want to do, I want to gather all my, um, let's gather, let's zoom out a little bit here. Let's gather all these armies here and then shift and pick up these here and that's 26 divisions uh we're going to get rid of the armor the uh the uh ss motorized and then here's a mountain division we're going to make sure they're all infantry divisions uh and they are okay and this is 21 divisions. I make my, uh, I set my armies up. Uh, a general can control 24 divisions. So I set them up 20 infantry and four tank divisions. So we have 20 infantry, let's get rid of one. And uh, we will create an army out of this. And we will call it the, um, uh, the first army. Wait a minute, what happened? Okay, so this will be our first army. And um, we, will we will assign it to um, von Manstein, my favorite German general. Um, his, uh, he, yeah, he, he, he's amazing. Okay, and we're going to set Manstein up over here at the Polish border. So we're going to assign him a front line one two three four five six provinces and we're also going in one of my playthroughs off camera i i set the front lines up here for all these um armies i had like four armies on the polish border and never set a offensive line up when the war started 
So yeah, you want to, after you set a front line up, I always make sure I set the offensive line up so I don't forget it because it gives you bonuses when you attack. So we'll put the offensive line for him something like um, something like this. Okay, we want him to capture Warsaw. Okay. And then um, and then we'll do that. Okay. And now we have a uh, uh, we have another uh, 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 army up here. We'll, right. just, we'll, we'll make this the second army. Uh, da, da, da. Okay, we'll call this the second army, and we'll give uh, it to uh, well, let's give it to Guderian Heinz. And uh, oh, we'll change that color from purple to hmm, blue. Okay, so Guderian. And uh, we have a cavalry. Well, if we go here, let's, let's, we want to change these also to the infantry division. Uh, so that'll change the cavalry. So we'll click OK. Uh, perfect. And. Um, We'll also give him a uh, give him a front line, and it'll be this, and then we'll give him a offensive orders, and we'll have that to be like right through here. Okay. All right, that's fine. Um. Is that everything? Are we ready to unpause the game? Uh, not just yet. Well, yeah, we are, but I want to... This is the is SS the division. Okay, so we're going to put it here. We'll put it here at Hamburg. Okay. Alright, now let's unpause the game. Put it at speed 4. Okay, and then there's this division here. Okay, so we have this division and this the SS, which has no, uh, which is not attached to any army. Uh, if I go here to my, let's pause the game real quick. If I go here to my air, we can select all of our air units. Oh shit, that was wrong. Go back, and that's wrong again. If I hold shift, is that selecting them? I guess it is. Thirteen selected, and we're going to disband all of them, put them in reserve. Okay. So we ha should have no air units out. Perfect. Uh, then if I go here, if we go to our naval, um... Okay, we're going to select this guy here. And if you uh, control, right click to set his home base, okay? And then move him there. And then select on the subs, control, right click, and move them there. And then get these guys over here. Move them there. We'll get our navy all together in one nice little area here. Okay. Now let's pause the game. Let's select our navies. Let's uh, get rid of that one. That one. And we will merge these two. Uh, we'll give them a commander. Um... We'll give them a raider and then the subs. We will merge them and give them donuts. Okay. All right. Uh, does it tell me if when I'm in production here of the Navy, 
can I select where they're going to be deploy target base ah perfect deploy target base we want them to go to um, shit what is it um, what the hell is this Schleswig Holsten. Okay. Is that the name of it? Or is that the state? Let's see. Let's go back here. Production. Ah, there. So we're going to have those. We're going to have the subs deploy there. We're going to have the destroyers. Can I just pick that? Oh, yeah. Perfect. We'll have everything deploy there. Convoys were stockpiling. And that guy's going there. Okay. Yeah, it's annoying when they deploy here, actually. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, great. Uh, do that. We have air unassigned divisions. We know. Okay. All right, so we're done with all. I think we're good to go. So let's... Uh, one last thing. Um... This is going to be called the Western Theater. Okay, the Western Theater, okay. All right, and let's unpause. Ah, we have uh we have 3 we have 3 Panzer divisions here. And we're going to create another army for them. And um uh, Um, we are going to, uh, this will be the first Spanish or the Spanish we'll call this the Spanish volunteers and we'll give this to Rommel. Okay. Uh, that way when the Spanish war starts the Spanish Civil War starts uh, we will send him and hopefully send all three divisions sometimes the Spanish War fires quite early and you can only send um, two divisions um, yeah so hopefully we will be able to send four okay let's go ahead and up it to speed five here at the beginning so what we're going to do we're going to set four armies up over here at the Polish border and then we're going to set up uh, Rundstedt down here at the uh, at the at the French border here along the Maginot line we're going to build up the west wall uh, get these land forts up to eight and here we go with the Spanish Civil War hit OK and so the Spanish Civil War has started so let's pause the game we'll go to over here we'll click on nationalist spain which is who we are supporting they're fighting republican spain and uh, we'll click on them and we will go to send volunteers and we can only send two okay perfect um back so i'm going to have to release one of these okay and um, I tell you what though, if I click here, recruit, uh, I see what the problem is. Um, the problem is not enough equipment. Now what I can do, I can, de can I go ahead, if I deploy these divisions, click to deploy all lines instantly. I've never tried that. Will that deploy these right now? It did. Okay, now they they need trained. So we have to click on them. And we're going to... Uh... 
we're going to create let's create the third army create the third army we'll put that um, we'll give that to give that to uh, Ernst here he's got pretty good bonuses winter specialist so we'll give him the third army and we'll have them training okay now can I send with that being done let's let the time go to 20 okay with that being done can we now send I uh, we still we can still only send two fine I thought that might help to me help for me to be able to send more troops but it didn't okay well we we did change that so let's go back here boom send volunteers we'll send Rommel <coughs> excuse me and send fine and they will accept okay yeah, that's that's a bit of a pisser. Um, that's a bit of a pisser. Um, three divisions would have been just perfect, but uh, we'll have to fight it with two, which we can do. But again, three would have been awesome because that's how many I have, and uh, we could have got, you know, experience, uh, ended the Spanish Civil War quicker. But fine. Okay, so uh, construction, yep. So we have, what is it, 16 civilian factories working here. And we just got our national focus uh, Rhineland, okay. So we've, uh, we've uh, militarized, re-militarized the Rhineland. Now, uh, here's, why, here's where I go strictly I want to get these industrial benefits here, which add, uh, you know, six civilian factories here and then another six here. Uh, so we're going to go to the Reichsautobahn. We're going to research it. The remilitarization of the Rhineland. Boom. So this was this was red earlier. Uh, meaning we couldn't put troops here. Uh, now it's not because we remilitarized it. Okay, our two divisions we sent are now. Now let's keep that at, at four. Okay, and let's find them. And they are here. Okay, so we'll move them here. And what are we looking at here? We are looking at mountains. Awesome. Uh, okay, this guy's being attacked from all sides, so let's go ahead and help them out here. Let's see if we can knock him out of this little hole here. Again, we have Panzers fighting in mountains, but he's being overwhelmed. And yeah, he's going to be done here real soon. And then we'll go ahead and uh, hit the city here. Let's move, let's move to here and we'll attack from a different direction. There we go. And I need some help from... Uh, it'd be great to have some help from the Spanish. Maybe, maybe not. Just somebody anybody you see I'm attacking here please help and they're not going to do it son of a bitch okay they're going to attack here and I'm going to attack an urban center with tanks which is not the best but uh, we're weighing him down looks like 
Ah, we got a little help. 77%. And we're getting some... Yeah, we got two divisions. My organization is shit. If we can take this, uh, then we'll regroup. 90%. Uh, electronic engineering. Okay, so we'll go with uh, mechanical computing, which minus 3% research time. Let's get that going. Back here. Alright, and they fail. Alright, so let's let these guys uh, get uh, the organization up, get a bit resupplied. Because we've lost a few troops. And uh, I guess we'll help him take out these guys here. Let's get, let's, we, we need, we need resupply. So let's spend just a little time here getting some reinforcements. Our strength, the fighting strength is at 85%. And it's taken forever to get reinforcements. Uh, so let's let's work on this guy here. Wow. And that failed. Let's try it again. Oh, he is he is gonna be a tough nut to crack. Yeah, I, I it's really helpful to get three divisions down here. Um, how are we doing on our production? What is the deal? Not enough equipment. Ah, I know what we need to do. We need to have uh, this prioritized. Let's get our production prioritized for equipment. There we go. Alright, that'll help with that. Oh, we took it. Okay, so great. So we'll get these guys. Jesus. Uh, okay, Italy took over Ethiopia. Let's pause it. Um, okay, so we've cleared this all out. Now let's go here, and we'll cut these guys off and try to clear out this pocket here. Here they come. Reich's auto bond, and then we're going to go to the west wall, which is going to add some. Um, it's going to give us some bonus for some bonuses. Uh, with uh, with a political advisor Fritz Tot, uh, and then it's going to add 12 land forts to the French border. So we'll take that. Sure. Okay. All right, and when, then we will. Um, what are we looking at here? Uh, planes. Okay, so let's hit him I here. Ah, two divisions is just not enough. And I'm also out of supply. What the hell? Okay, we did it anyhow. And then we're going to go ahead and get morning time. Let's get him here. Okay, we got the anti-tank gun. And basic machine tools. Uh, the anti-tank. Okay, great. Um, let's get here. And we want to go ahead and do radio. So we'll research that. And then basic machine tools. We want to... Oh, shit. I, did, I really didn't want to do radio. I wanted to do... Yeah, we're going to change that. Factory output, dockyard output. We want to do this one. Let's go back to 
radio and we'll switch that to construct a uh, concentrated industry yes okay okay and we'll, we'll we'll take this hopefully relatively soon we are fighting in the forest so we got tanks in the forest now um, let's build up a bit of well shit we can get across the river here so let's, let's do that real quick get across the river Okay, build up our organization a teen bit. He just let's let's get this hill here if we can. Oh, is he gonna? He's he's leaving it. Let's see. No, he's being. Let's let's hit him here. We are attacking a mountain, but look at him. His organization is shit, and we got the mountain. Perfect. Um, we're being attacked. That's fine. And he's attacking here, but they got 10 divisions here. Holy shit, that's a lot. Um, maybe we'll... Let's go here. There we go. What are you doing? Wow, that's very slow. Oh, we're out of supply again. Okay, we got that. All right, now we need to uh, let's take Barcelona, and that is holy shit, uh, not going to work. I have no help. We have absolutely nobody helping us here, attacking Barcelona. Okay, stop. Okay, we'll pivot. These guys are out of supply. They are in a mountain, though. They are in a mountain. All of these guys should be out of supply. Right? It's not showing. It's not showing out of supply. But there is a skull next to him. He's, I guess he's just suffering attrition. Uh, and he's putting more divisions there. Okay, construction. And we will go with... Uh, resource gain 10% or... Construction speed. Hmm. Well, that's 37, so that's... Oh, shit, I'm re... Oh, shit. We are researching that early. Fine. Research. What the hell? Okay, we can modify our government. Um, Let's do anything that'll help us with industry. Do we have a political advisor for industry? We should have war industry, military construction speed... 10% dockyard. Hmm. Captain of industry, civilian construction speed, 10% infrastructure, refinery. We are already producing refineries. Infrastructure, civilian. Prince of Terror, that's going to be a good one to have. So we have three slots here. Which ones are we going to want? Armaments? Civilian military fire convert? No. Fortification. We're going to want the fortification. We're going to want Hamler. And then we have to decide do we want Captain of Industry or do we want War Industrialist? This is military and dockyard. This is civilian and refineries. Oof. I don't even know if I want any of those to be honest. Silent workhorse. Political power gain plus 15%. Wow. 
Uh, I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Because we want political power right now. So let's go with political power, Himmler, and fortifications. We'll do that. Okay. Um... Wow, have I not, have I been ignoring this? Holy shit, I can, I've got a bunch of political power, okay. Uh, this one here is, we don't want to do right now. Um, industrial concern, corrupt steel, industrial research time, minus 10%. We'll take that. Okay, and getting back here, uh, we are trying to get these guys out of the mountains, and it is taking a bit of time, but I think we're wearing them down, 79%, and we get this pocket here cleared up, uh, yeah, that'll be nice, I gotta pay attention to this up here, holy shit, I had a lot of political power I wasn't using, uh, Oh, this is a slugfest. Yeah, tanks fighting, tanks attacking a mountain is is never good, but we're helping out a little bit, I guess. It's just taking forever to get this, this guy's a slot. West wall, okay, so go to details here. And now we'll go to industrial effort, which will give us six civilian factories. That'll be freaking awesome. Okay, and we're still plugging away, trying to get him dislodged. We're at 80%. Come on, guys. Take him out. Take him out. Finish it off. Finish it. My God. Down to 70%. These mountains, man. These mountains. Okay, yeah, this is going to... Let's speed it up. Holy shit. My god, they're, they're barely even moving. We'll finally get them, but holy... Oh, there they go. I think they're about to fold. 56%. They put fresh troops in there. <laughs> Okay. Wow, that is a tough nut to crack. But I'm not giving up, damn it. Uh, or maybe I should. Maybe we should switch and take Barcelona? Nah, we'll stick with it. Wow, this is taking forever. Okay, industrial effort, there we go. And then we'll take industrial effort too, which will give us six more. Los, los, los. Wow, this is, again, I think we're gonna have to just, yeah, okay. We are going to uh, let, <clears throat> we're gonna let that go. We're gonna move these tanks awesome. around to here. Gonna let them heal up a little bit and we'll hit Barcelona. Maybe we'll get some guys. Maybe we'll get some help. And we're getting no help in Barcelona. Okay. Well, we're going to continue working. This is not going the best. Um, we're gonna continue working on. Ah, we can send another one. Okay, that, that will help. Uh, let's get this other. Right, this guy second. here, we'll, we'll create an army, we'll throw in Hauser. <clears throat> Go back here. Send volunteers, Hauser, and send. 
perfect. That'll give us three light armor divisions. <clears throat> wow. That is going terrible. Okay. Um. Alright, so we're just going to hold on. We'll get Hauser. We'll have three light tanks, and then we'll... We will probably... Holy shit, these guys are doing terrible. We will probably try to take Madrid, and we'll we'll probably attack here. It's, it's hills, and then we have some planes here, and we'll go straight for the capital and help them out here and, and leave this mess alone. Okay, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm, I'm very excited to be playing my first ever Hearts of Iron uh, series on YouTube, and we'll see how it goes.